So we are moving uh, to the second question in the section A. Uh, I'll start with the uh, main uh, theme on that. Uh, developing mindfulness in a day-to-day -day life. You briefly uh, gave some input. How to spend the day with mindfulness? Question number one, how can someone integrate mindfulness into their daily uh, routines? Or can you share some practical tips in your, uh, uh, that you have experienced in your life, especially those with busy lives uh, to improve focus and productivity? So focus yeah. and productivity is, are the two main distractions uh, that impact our lives. I would recommend people to do uh, one minute meditation first. Okay. One minute meditation. Minute meditation. Yeah. How can one practice meditation for one minute or in one minute? Whatever you are doing, whatever work you are, you are doing, stop it for a for, for, for stop that moment. Yes. Of course, whatever you're doing, you must stop. When I say that, don't stop while you're driving. <laughs> but yes. any other activity. Yes. Whether you're sitting, standing, whatever. Yes. And you stop it and deep breathe. I mean, take a deep breath mm. and breathe out very slowly. Normally, only 60% of our breath we breathe out. Yes. 40% remains in our lungs. Okay. So we have to breathe out that 40% also. Okay. So that our lungs will be totally free from in breath. Yes. Totally free. And the capacity of lungs becomes yes. bigger. When you breathe in, you can get lung full of oxygen. Yeah, yeah. Every time we breathe in, we breathe oxygen. Yes. This oxygen charge all our red blood cells. Yes. Several trillions of red blood cells yes. come to our lungs. Mm -hmm. They all collect from our, all our body, go to the heart, heart pumps to the lungs, and then when we breathe in, yes. we charge all these red blood cells with oxygen. Yeah. That goes to the heart yes. and heart pumps again. Yes. This is happening every time we breathe in and breathe in. Yes. It is said that we breathe between 22,000 times a day. Right. 22,000 times a day. Mm -hmm. So this time, it, all this uh, red blood cells goes, it circulates all over our body. Right. That way, every cell, 36 trillion cells in our body, yes. among, uh, in men, and 28 trillion cells in, the, in female. Yes. It is said, I don't know, that that's what I, that's what the information I get. Yes. So all these cells need oxygen. So the body always get good oxygen. And they always are in a state of flux, yes. changing, 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 vibrating, vibrating, vibrating all the time. Yes. And then, I said all these things with regard to one minute meditation. Yes. I, in order for you to understand the background of why we do one minute meditation. Yes. So you stop whatever you are doing, take, breathe 15 times, and breathe out 15 times, and open your eyes, all the mental, all the tension mm. that was built up up to the point you stop, stopped your work will all be gone. And then you continue your work. Yes. For another 58 minutes. Yes. And then stop and breathe, stop and breathe like this yeah. for another 15 times. Yes. That way you can integrate your meditation to your body. Yes. And your life yes. and your two activities. So that when you come home at night in the evening, you would have had at least fifteen to twenty minutes, sixteen minutes meditation in your daytime. Okay. Thank you, Vante. 
get. So you already answered our second question. So I'm not going to repeat it. Great. Uh, so the next one is, can you share some example of how mindfulness has positively impacted your own life and work? Yeah, uh, my own life and work? Yes. Yeah. yes. Actually, I can keep my mind clear because of the practice of mindfulness. Okay. I speak clearly, I write clearly, I try to understand clearly because I want to know, I, I want to convey my ideas to other people mm -hmm. clearly. Right. My purpose is to make others understand. When I talk, I want to make others, I, I want others to understand me. Yes. And therefore, I have to keep my mind clear. Yes. In order to keep my mind clear, I keep always, I, I keep practicing mindfulness, meditation. Mm -hmm. Even at night when I go to bed, I sleep with mindfulness. When I wake up, sometimes at night, several times, yes. as soon as I wake up, I go to the bathroom and lay down and start practicing. That way my mind remains fresh, clear uh, of all other uh, defilements. Yeah. So when you do your long uh, meditation, so you practice the mindfulness, so you, you are aware where you are, you live in the presence. Right, right. 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 Moreover, I can tell you how I started meditation. Yeah, sure, please. In 1947. Okay. I was 20 years old. Right. Prior to that, I had a photographic memory. Yes. I could read this thick book in 15 minutes and remember everything. I simply have to scan. Yes. But at the age of 20, I lost everything. Yes, yes. I lost it's everything. Right. And then, my teachers, parents, and so forth did everything they knew to recover my memory. Yeah. They could not do anything. After about a year, I thought I, I knew the meditation theory before I lost my memory. Yeah. I thought if I practice meditation, hmm. my memory would return. So I started meditating. At night, when everybody goes to bed, I sit on my bed and meditate. When I did this for about six months, oh, my memory began to return slowly and slowly. Prior to that, when I lost my memory, I could not recognize alphabet of any language that I studied. I studied Pali, Singhal, Singhalese, Sanskrit, and Tamil, four languages. I could not recognize even single his alphabet. So, were you able to find out the root cause for that, Pante? What was the reason you lost the memory? The reason I lost was we, were, we, did, the, we did one week chanting. Yeah. We did one week chanting day and night. Uh, some experienced monks did not uh, chant continuously. Yeah. They chanted for about an hour or so and then had a break. Yeah. But myself and my friend, we both of us, uh, chanted the whole night, whole day, seven days. So it had put pressure, uh, stress on you? Stress. Oh. Even without eating, sometimes it, we drank, yeah. ate very little, very quickly and started chanting, very loudly. At the end of the week, seven days, we both lost our memories. Oh. Both Is that so? became sick. Yeah. And that is how I lost the memory. Yeah. 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 Okay. We are so glad you got the memory back. Not all but, of it, yeah. but at least I was able to Yeah, be. sure, sure. Yeah.